Hello, this is Stampy, and welcome to episode 2 of my Sims 4 Let's Play. I am here having a chat with Lee, talking about garbage and boxing gloves. As you do, as you do. Anyway, let's pause time, because there's not much that they can do. And look, look how busy it's getting. Look at all these people going over the place. Look at all these people. <laughs> I wonder what she's thinking right now. Right, here's, here's a caption competition. Write in the comments what you think both of these people are thinking. What's he thinking and what's she thinking right now? Because he doesn't look very happy and she looks... I don't know. It looks like he's really angry and telling her to follow and she's like, okay. <laughs> Here they go. Look at them walking. <laughs> look how close together they're walking and look at her. <laughs> oh dear. You look like you got some, some face on your paint there. Face on your paint, paint on your face. Oh dear, oh dear. Anyway, I have some crazy neighbours. It's getting very busy around here, but uh, while they all wander around, I am going to get to work building. And so this is what I built in the last episode. Uh, it's kind of a, an empty shell of a house right now, but it looks okay. It looks alright. There we go. Look, it's a, it's an actual proper real house, and I did it. Yay! Well done me. But it's very empty, and so we need to go and start trying to fill it up. So let's go back into build mode, and uh, let's see what we can do here. So uh, I guess we need to do the, the kitchen first. The most important thing in Sims is to have a fridge. Uh, let's go for let's go for this one, and let's get a, a nice coloured one, shall we? Let's go for a, a nice dark grey one. Oh no, it's, it's kind of camouflaged if I do that against the wall. <laughs> let's go for um, let's have all the kitchen stuff around here then, shall we? Uh, against actually no, it'd be a bit weird there. That should be the living room by the front of the house maybe. Uh, so let's have the kitchen stuff here. It's kind of in the way of Lee's room a bit, but oh well, he'll get used to it. And uh, let's do some some countertops then, shall we? Uh, okay, I need to make sure I don't always get the expensive ones. These ones are cool. I could go for a set of these ones. What colours can we go for? Uh, let's go for these nice orangey ones, shall we? And let's do ooh, a little bit blocking the window. Might have to move that window. Then let's do that one there. And then we can do this one if we do it in the same colour. Uh, can be in the, in the middle, maybe? Uh, if I want to do it like that. And that can kind of fit in. Um... <laughs> it's a little bit messy. It's a little bit going through the wall. Right, I'm gonna have to sort this out, aren't I? I can't leave it like this. Right, so the fridge can move along to here, and that can move along to there, I guess. That's not going through the wall, is it? Nope. And then that one can go along to there. It's weird how it kind of sticks out a bit. I thought it was gonna match a little bit better. Maybe if I have that one next to the, the fridge, and then have this one here and this one here. That looks a little bit better. It's just the window which is making it look a little bit rubbish. Let's just sell it. Let's just sell the window, shall we? There we go. I got my money back for that. And uh, we can maybe have some little windows. Uh, let's go and do uh, a nice little window on the top. Ah, these are all curtains. Oh, these are all curtains and blinds and things. Okay, I can maybe add them in a little bit later. But first I need to do uh, a window. And so I guess it's going to have to be... Oh, this is cool. Ah, there we go. I like it. I like it. I like it. Right, so I got my I got my fridge and I got my counters. I guess I should probably add an oven in. I don't really leave much room for it, did I? The yum cooker. <laughs> There's the cooking you pro. Oh, look at this. God, oh, God, that's like two thousand and three thousand. Okay, they get expensive fast. Let's have a good old-fashioned yum cooker then. We don't need to be fancy here, do we? And I've already realised that I have no room to put the cooker anywhere. Right, let's get rid of this one because that one's a bit weird anyway. Let's move that one across and put the cooker in the middle. There we go. Here's my here's my kitchen complete. And so let's start doing... Uh, I guess I need to put a table and chairs in, I guess. Uh, where are tables? Tables anywhere around here? Um, it's not going to be in counters, is it? These are... Oh, these are all bar stools. Okay, so this is me switching through the room. So I guess this is all the kitchen things. I guess if I go to dining rooms, here we go. Now I'm going to be able to find some tables. Oh, there's a new one. Uh, white all-night dining tables. Uh, that's 500, though. Uh, we don't need a big one because it's really just us. This one's quite cool. That one's quite nice as well, actually, though. Let's go for, let's go for this one. And uh, let's just have it uh, down near the kitchen. It kind of matches. It kind of matches everything else as well. Um, I think it looks best this way around actually. Let's move that back and uh, now I need to go and get some get some chairs. So uh, I'm trying to get everything matching now. So I think this should match. There we go. And do another one on that side. Here we go. This is where me and Lee can eat our meals together. Should we have some some decoration on the table? Uh, what could we put? Let's have a, a bowl of fruit on the table there that they can eat. And it's probably going to go mouldy and her flies all round it. But oh well. <laughs> we'll deal with that when it happens. I know there's a, an old antique teapot here and all sorts of cool things. Let's actually go back to, to kitchens and see if there's anything else. Maybe a, a coffee machine or something. Oh, we could add a microwave. 
Um, let, let, let's add a let's add a Joe Jockey uh, coffee thing there and a cooker. This should be enough. This should be everything we need. Oh, actually, I want alarms. I definitely want alarms. Uh, let's have this smoke alarm here, and let's have this very close to the uh, the cooker, shall we? <laughs> and so that will basically, uh, if there's a fire, it will start beeping and automatically call a uh, someone from the uh, the fire brigade. Uh, so that would be very useful. And look at this! Look at this trash can. It's like a it's like a big like barrel. And what's this one? Nano can, touchless trash can. That's a bit fancy for me. Let's just go for this one. And uh, is this gonna fit down here or down here? Nope. Okay, I'm just gonna do it down here. It's like literally just a massive barrel, isn't it? <laughs> Let's have it in between our rooms if I turn it around. Is it not gonna fit there? Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to have it against this wall here. There we go, just a massive barrel. <laughs> there we go, here's the kitchen. And now let's go and do the, the living room. So we've got kitchen, dining room, then living room's gonna be here, I guess. So if I switch to living room, uh, the most important thing, of course, is the television. And I can have penguin vision television set. <laughs> oh, should we just have this? So that, shall, shall that just be our TV? Does it need to be on something or should I put it on the floor? Uh, okay, let's just put it down from the floor for now, but I guess we should probably get a little table to put it on top of. Um, here we go. Here are some TV stands. Uh, the show horn. There's this one. Can I not just get like a little little table and put it on? A little. Oh, these are like nightstands. Oh, what about this? Ah, huh? if I do that there, then put that on top. There we go. <laughs> and whenever we're watching TV, we're just going to be staring out the window as well. But it doesn't matter. All right, let's go grab ourselves a, a nice sofa then. I feel like I've been spending too much, so I might just go and get the... Uh, the cheapest one for now. Uh, let's get a nice bright yellow one though. Uh, we're going to be sitting quite close to the TV, uh, but that's okay because the TV's so tiny we probably want to be sitting quite close to it. <laughs> oh dear, and the big barrel there as well. Let's move this into the corner of the room then, shall we? That doesn't need to be where it was. And uh, I think we need to add some lights. It's all looking quite dark at the moment. So let's go and add some lights in. Let there be light laser show. Hello. Okay, well maybe one day when we have a party uh, I can get that. Uh, for now, I guess we should start thinking about some more normal lights. Oh, look, there's like dangly lights here, like lights we can put on the ceiling. Uh, what about this one? This one's quite a nice one. Let's just put that in the middle of the room up there. And uh, let's boot, just do a, a lamp as well. Uh, what one should we go for? This is quite cool. Just say like this light's called Cloud or Claude or something. Let's just do this one about here. And uh, you can see, you can actually see as I move it around how it lights up the room. That's quite cool. And uh, let's go and do the other uh, lights for everyone else's room. Let's have a, a kid's floor light for my room. Have that in the corner of the room. <laughs> and I guess we should start uh, thinking about doing our, our bedrooms anyway then, shouldn't we? So uh, let's go see what beds we have here. Uh, oh, this one's uncomfortable for adults. Anti-goblin bed by Kidamaid. <laughs> uh, let's go for Let's have a nice one because we're going to be sleeping in it a lot. Whoa! Okay, that's probably a big waste of money, but this bed is so cool, I just got to have it. Look at it! Look at that thing! I look like I'm going to go to the future with it, not go to sleep. <laughs> and I guess um, Lee's going to want a luxurious one, isn't he? So uh, he can go and have this fancy one here. And uh, what colour is going to fit in with the rest of the room? Uh, this one looks okay. And so he can have his nice luxurious one here. Let me just spin that around and uh, put it against the wall there. And I guess he wants some some lights for his room as well, I would assume. Uh, let's go and do a little uh, bedside table. And uh, then we can go and put like a little light or something on it. Uh, he can just have this little one down here. Let me just go and spin it around and plonk it down. And I can do one for me as well. Uh, this one's quite cool, a dreamland nightstand. Let's go and put that down next to me. And uh, what should we put on top of them then? So I guess Lee can have a, a little light. Oh, these are just all clocks. Okay, let's get a, a little light for Lee first then. A little bedside light. Are there any of them? Any little ones? Like any little desk light type things that I can put next to him? I mean, there's that one. It's not very bedroomy. These ones are okay, actually. Uh, it's quite expensive, but uh, this is for Lee. So <laughs> no expenses spared. And uh, I can have a, a little clock next to me then, I guess. A little bedside clock. Uh, I don't know though, I don't really like the look of them. What can I have next to me? What would it look cool? I could have some flowers? It's probably not a good idea because I have hay fever. Ooh! Oh look! Oh, these are all for kids' bedroom things, I think. Or are these just things for kids in general? <laughs> oh dear, I guess maybe I could have something like this. Remember? In the last episode, I set my um, I set my trait to uh, childish, so it's going to be good to have this. Why would I want to add a pile of laundry? I want to clean up a pile of laundry, not have a pile of laundry. I could put a little teddy there. Oh, it's a massive teddy. 
little helicopter. I can put a little helicopter on my desk. And I can put a little monster down here as well. And anything else that I can put in there. Can I put a little robot? Oh, and a little robot. There we go. That is what I want by the side of my bed. <laughs> oh dear, I love it. I guess I should start thinking about doing some... Uh, some wardrobes and things then as well and I've got to be really careful because I'm fast running out of money <laughs> and once I run out I'm not going to be getting any back until we've got jobs and I don't want to have jobs I just want to play all day all right let's just have some some little dresses for now then but I guess Lee will have a proper wardrobe I don't know they're so expensive though 1000 monies for a wardrobe uh, let's go and have let's have uh I'll have this one for me then this one's this one's very cheap and uh, let's go for this color and I can plonk this uh, down here. There we go. I don't have much room in my bedroom, do I? And uh, then for Lee, he can have this one. A slightly nicer one for Lee. And uh, I'm not really worried about the colour. So this one will do. Have you noticed how our rooms are like exactly the same, but just with different materials in? I'm not very imaginative, am I? And uh, this window might need to go. That's a bit of a big window. He's got another window there anyway. So I might get rid of this one. Give me a little, of, uh, little bit of money back as well anyway. So <laughs> can't be that bad of a thing. And now the final room to do is going to be the bedroom. And don't worry, I will be expanding and extending my house in the future. I just wanted uh, something set up for now. So uh, let's go and start doing our showers and things. So I'm going to be cheap. I'm going to be good now. I'm going to go for all the cheapest options uh, just to try and save money so I can buy some more fun things later on. So I've got my nice shower down there. I, of course, need a potty, a nice toilet I can put down. No, 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 don't go for the fancy ones. Go for the basic ones, basic one. Uh, I don't want a green one, though. That's horrible. Let's go for a black one. There we go. <laughs> there we go. You're not going to see any mess in it if it's black. <laughs> so let's put that one down there. And now let's do a sink. Once again, I'm going to be good. Nice, basic sink. Uh, I'll do the sink uh, over here so everything's not in a row. Looks a bit weird. And uh, is that all I need? I can maybe put a rug down. I uh, will make it look quite nice. A rug uh, maybe along here. Why does it matter what way it's facing? Uh, let's just do the rug in the middle of the room like that. That looks okay. That looks quite cool. And uh, I can maybe put some little paintings up. I suppose I'm going to worry about decorating everything at some point in the future anyway. Uh, so let me just go and put the little mirror in here. And here we go. This is Stampy's lovely home. I do like it. I do like it. It's a bit... Well, I don't know. It looks like I've designed it. Let's just put it that way. But I think it's okay. So I like it. But the big question is, will the other me like it? And look at the crowd that's assembled here. They've all come to admire the house. <laughs> right, let's continue our time and uh, let's bring them inside and see if they see if they enjoy it. Uh, go here together. So now we can have a uh, Lee and Stampy walking into the house and look at Lee's walk. <laughs> Why is Lee walking like that? I didn't set him to walk like that, did I? Oh well. <laughs> And they come in, don't even look at the house, I just start talking about police cars. Really? I'll have a look around. Have a look around. You can you can go to you have a look in your room. And then Lee, you go and have a look in you go and have a look in your room. And uh, then they're they're they see if they like it or not. I think I should take a picture of this as well, actually. I'm gonna get them together, then I'm gonna uh, take a picture for the for the album. Actually, I might do one of here, then both looking in their their own rooms. If I go like this, uh, I should take a screenshot. There we go. Would you like to make a memory? Uh, this dialogue can be disabled in the gameplay section. Um, sure, let's make a memory. I think I can just press C whenever I want to take a snapshot. Are you literally just going to stand in your room? There you go. Play with some of your toys. There we go. Straight to the robot to play with it. <laughs> Do you not want to play with your, your light at all? Oh, he wants to go look at the penguin. <laughs> He's been attracted to that. What's he watching? NBD. He's watching the news. How boring. Uh, watch channel... Oh yeah, he likes cooking, doesn't he? Why didn't he put on the uh, the cooking channel? Oh yeah, I didn't mention this. Lee is literally going to be cooking my breakfast every morning, just like in Minecraft. So <laughs> it makes sense if he's going to be watching a cooking show. And while he's doing that, I am playing with my robot and thinking about unicorns. <laughs> oh dear. Actually... Something that we are going to have to do is um, we, get, we are going to have to get a job. And I think to do that, I think the best way is to, to get a computer first. So uh, I did realise that we don't have a computer and uh, it's kind of hard to live life without a computer these days. So uh, let me go back to build mode and uh, let me try and figure out where I'm going to fit a computer in. <laughs> Maybe in one of our bedrooms? And if you haven't seen uh, Lee's, um, Lee's door yet, by the way, look, check this out. Actually, I've gone too high. If I do this, there we go. There's Lee's. <laughs> Lee's very elegant door. I love that. Right, let's try and find a place where we can have a desk. Maybe we can do a um, 
just a single desk maybe? Or they all oh, know they're all quite big, aren't they? Right, is this gonna fit in anywhere? Um Well we could I know what to do. Let me just plonk this down anywhere for now, so it's just here. Let's put it in the garden for now. And uh, let's just move everything Oh, sorry Lee, sorry Lee. <laughs> He's fine though. If I just move everything along like this, and if I move the light to this little corner, is that not gonna fit in? No? Okay, let's put the, the light here then. Is this barrel gonna fit in? No, okay, let's put the barrel here, and then will the desk fit in here? Almost. Alright, let's move this, um, let's move the barrel and light out the way for now. Uh, okay, let's put the barrel and light outside. No, don't mean to move the room. And then let's go and put the desk here, and then this can be where the, the computer's gonna be. And I just need to find somewhere else for the bin. It can go there. <laughs> and the light can go... Right. Uh, this is so horrible. If I move this along... And then the light can go here. They can still see that, can't they? Of course they can. Right, let's go and add in a, a computer then, right? It's going to be basic. Oh, look at that. How low can you go, desk block computer? I can't make them use that, can I? I could give them the slab. Oh, it's a portable one, that one. Right, uh, let's go for this one. Mid-range desktop. I can't I can't go for that one. I couldn't bear it. I couldn't bear to put them through it. <laughs> right, let's go and just plonk the computer down here. And uh, they need a, a desk chair as well. Let's just go uh, for a simple one. Uh, I think that one's for kids, that one. Let's just go for a basic bog standard uh, desk chair. And now they, at least can, they can use the computer. And uh, now they're going to be able to get a job. And then we're going to have a little a little desk light here as well. A little panda. <laughs> and a little robot on the other side. There we go. Lots of lights. <laughs> I might just get rid of um, uh, this other light for, for now then. I might just get rid of this one. Because it's in the way. And I'm not, actually, I could put, it, could put it in Lee's room. Put it in Lee's room. Lee's not got a standing light. So there we go. Problem solved. My house is now rearranged. Look at this place. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. Oh, well. Let's carry on. Game on then. Game on. Let's carry on. Uh, carry on living then. Uh, sorry, Lee. I kind of I kind of moved it a little bit. Um, you can go and uh, you can go and carry on. You can watch the kids network for a bit. And then that means Stampy uh, is going to come and come and join you, I guess. He can come and join you on the kids' network. He's going to take his robot with him. <laughs> He's not going to leave the robot there. He's going to take it with him. Come on, Lee. Are you going to you going to join us? Okay, come watch the uh, come watch the kids' channel with us. Put your phone away. Put your phone away, and then uh, we can watch a little bit of TV. This is your your small amount of uh, leisure time until I make you guys both start to to get jobs. <laughs> I do, I do like this house though. It is a mess. It's all over the place. It's random, but I do like it. It is uh, pretty cool. So I uh, tell you what, let's go and get Lee on the computer and let's see if he can start finding a job. Here we go. Find a job. What sort of job would Lee do? The aim is I want to try and have him eventually uh, being a chef. Like I've said it so he wants to be a good cook. And I've also said it uh, so he's ambitious. So he's going to be happy when he's uh, doing well at a job. And so that's going to be the the, the, the first goal. And uh, let's see how I'm doing. So uh, I'm pretty good overall. My bladder's going down a little bit. Uh, this is everything about me. Yeah, so let me just show you wh what Lee is. So he's ambitious. Uh, he loves uh, flavour. He's a foodie and he's cheerful as well. So uh, you can see what, what he's like. And you can see we're a little bit friends now. We're very slightly friends. <laughs> which is uh, always good to know. So I guess Lee can go and start uh, getting to work, uh, getting a job. While I stay uh, watching the uh, watching the penguin TV, <laughs> and look where I've left my robot. I'm just gonna put my robot down there in the way. Here we go. Select select a career for Lee. Uh, it's got to be this one then. It's got to be a uh, cooking. Uh, what's he gonna be? Is he actually gonna be a chef? Anyone can make dinner or mix a drink at home. The culinary career is for those who want to take it to another level, another level, and make money doing it. Uh, career branches: chef and mixologist. Ooh, okay. So let's do that. Now hiring. Assistant dishwasher. <laughs> it made it sound it's so dramatic, didn't it? Uh, but it's assistant dishwasher. And it's only part-time. I think it's only on Tuesdays and Thursdays. It will do, though. It's a, a step in the right direction. And so here we go. He's managed to get that job. And uh, I guess I'm going to stay at home. But I'm, I might try and get a job from home. I, might, I don't know, I might try and get a, a job doing Minecraft Let's Plays or something. And I love that robot. I really love that robot, don't I? <laughs> and so did did I get the job? Was was I able to... Did I get it? And so I guess I need to now uh, get Lee to, to practice uh, being a chef. Maybe I can make him cook something. Is he at all hungry yet? Neither of us are very hungry yet. So I guess he can go and uh, back to, to watching uh, the cooking channel. 
and then you can get some ideas. That's all you need to be a chef. All you need to do uh, is watching, uh, is to watch food shows <laughs> on TV, and uh, then you can go and be a chef. So uh, we're settled now. We have our house. I'm happy with it. Uh, we got Lee already a job as a dishwasher. I got a job playing with my robot. And so in the next episode, I'm going to go and uh, give us a phone. And I'm going to call up some friends and uh, invite them around. And uh, yeah, we can go and introduce ourselves to the neighbours. But sadly, that's the end of this episode here. I want to thank you all very much for watching. And I will see you all later. Bye!